Hi there, and welcome back to Hillbilly Storytime Pentest Fails with me, Adam Compton. Today, we're not going to be doing a standard story format. Uh, I'm actually going to start a new series that's going to be interweaved in and out of uh, the standard one of uh, guest uh, storytellers that'll come on and tell Pentest fail stories or issues that they've encountered themselves, and they just feel like they want to share it out with the world. Uh, this first one is going to come from a friend of mine. Uh, his name is Leon. He's going to be talking to you a little bit about some fun and uh, issues that arose with uh, going after some web-based cameras during an engagement. So uh, now I'm just going to pass it on over to Leon to see what he has to say, and I'll see you back after the break. So I've had a lot of uh, situations that I could probably talk about. Um, I'll go with the university that I once tested, we'll leave it nameless. <laughs> so one time I was uh, doing this assessment for this university and um, I'm finding out a lot of things. I'm moving around, I'm, I'm gaining access to a lot of boxes. I think at some point I was already DA and I was just kind of looking for treasure and other things and different attack vectors and different uh, avenues of ways to get in. And so uh, at some point uh, I get a hold of uh, I start realizing that they have webcams everywhere. And so I start literally like just compromising all the webcams of this place just to find out what I can see. And uh, I had some really cool, cool shots. Uh, I got into this one webcam where I could pan, it was a really high end webcam, and I could pan into this point where I could see someone like punching in numbers for a door. So I was just waiting for people to go by so I could capture the punch in the numbers so I could, you know, prove a concept that I could show up and, you know, gain access, physical access to the building. Uh, there was another office I gave access to where I, I turned the camera around and I saw passwords written on the board, so I was collecting those. And so I was just going through all the cameras, collecting them. And then, so I get to this one camera, and it has, it's a view of a freeway, kind of like what looks behind me. And I was like, that's odd, but I could move it. So I start moving it around, and I see it's in an office. So I start panning the office again, looking for information. So I start zooming in on things, and, and uh, it's, like I said, really good cameras. So I start zooming in on the desk, and I can see writing, and I'm trying to make it out. What is this? Is this a password? Is this some type of information? I start zooming around on the chalkboard and the whiteboard and things. And so I'm constantly moving around. At some point, the camera just automatically shuts back and goes to the, uh, the freeway. And I'm like, that's odd. Like, I wonder if it's on some kind of timer and it kind of checked its setting and it goes. So I start zooming again and I start moving around and I'm, I'm looking again at the office and uh, I start seeing stuff and I'm just like, so it's just constantly moving around the office, constantly looking at different things and just looking for some sort of information. Again, it shoots back at around the same time frame and I'm like, that's odd. I've never, I've never seen this before. I don't know what's going on. So I start doing it again and doing it again. Uh, at some point, <laughs> uh, it doesn't zoom back. It, it changes, and I see a person's face. <laughs> and there's a person looking at it, and they're just staring at the cam. And I realize, oh, uh, this is not a time. Someone's manually turning the camera. So I, I look up the, the, manu the, the model number of the camera, and I pull up what it looks like. And it's like this elongated camera that kind of, you can tell which way it's facing by the way it moves around. And uh, I, I find a YouTube clip of it, and it makes it sound like, mm, mm, mm. so it's like not discreet at all. <laughs> and uh, <coughs> I find out uh, that what happened was this camera was set up for this university's, one of their main sites for weather and traffic. Uh, so if, if I go to a different URL, and I see that camera, and, it <laughs> and they were using it to keep the temperature and show you the traffic of what it was like on this freeway. <laughs> and so everybody that goes to that university site, that's the first thing they see is this, this website. So when you look at the history of it, and it takes screenshots to show you what the history was like in traffic at this time and this time, and all you see is pictures of the desk <laughs> and passwords and all these things that I was looking at. And what I didn't realize I was doing was I was like basically changing their, I was defacing their website by trying to find passwords. And I thought that was hilarious. Uh, they did not find it so funny, but uh, you know, it, it was there's no harm done, no foul. I didn't really see any passwords in that room, but uh, I thought that was kind of a, that was a, a, a fumble, if you will. <laughs> so that was one of my mess ups. Well, I hope you enjoyed that story from our guest storyteller today. Uh, as with all the stories, if you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. And if you'd like to be updated to any new videos or uh, anything new that's posted on this channel, please hit the subscribe button. And always. Thank you and have an awesome day.